Cheers, everyone. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, or should I say, hola everyone, happy Cinco de Mayo, ole, yeah, so I am so excited, can you imagine, I got to dress up twice this week, I know, we had the wine Wednesday that I got to dress up for the Wednesday before Cinco de Mayo, I think we all do that, right, and then of course we had Timu Tuesday, so excited about that, and now we're on Friday and it's Cinco de Mayo. Mayo. So I'm so excited to be having a margarita tonight dressed up in my Cinco de Mayo dress or whatever kind of dress you want to call it. And of course my Day of the Dead little headband here with lace on it. Just a fun little dress. This is probably six years old, six or seven years old. Yeah, it doesn't quite fit the same as it did six or seven years ago, but you know what? It's festive. That's good enough for me. So I've had this tequila in my freezer. It's probably going on five years. You would think I, I drink a lot, but I really don't. And uh, yeah, and of course, sometimes I have to give up because this cap hates me. This cap hates me. As you can see from all the uh, banging marks here, every time I want it, I've got to bang the living daylights out of this cap to get it open. My handy dandy opener doesn't work on it. Running it under hot water doesn't always help. Sometimes I give up and I walk next door and and uh, I need help. Can you open this for me? And then of course I give them a couple of shots too. But you know, tonight it opened for me. A comma's on my side. And I had this Jose Cuervo margarita mix that we bought when Raina was here. We were going to have margaritas. We could just never fit it in. We had so many other things that we were doing. So anyway, I've got a whole bottle. So, and I got my margarita ready to go. Got my salted rim here, my margarita glass. I got these years ago with a matching pitcher. I think I got it up here one. I don't even know if it's still around, but anyway, love this glass. Hope everyone is having a fantastic Friday. Hope your work day is over and uh, we're just going to have a little bit of fun today. So anyway, cheers everyone. Happy Cinco de Mayo. And you have to drink this fast because this white thing, it spills very easy. So I've got a ton of napkins here. It is so good. I could probably have a beach towel here in case it spills. Anyway, going to have another sip. Cheers, everyone. It's happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy Friday. Happy weekend. Hope everyone is having a great time tonight. Alrighty. So anyway, I knew I wanted to have like some kind of Mexican taco pizza place that I've, there's different places around us that have some really decent pizzas. Not like back home. Back home, every pizza place was perfect. This out here, not so much. But anyway, they, this place has either a chicken fajita sometimes or a taco. I've had their taco before that's just covered with lettuce and tomato. This time it didn't have it. I went online early today because I figured they're going to be busy. So they opened at 11. I put my order in 11 and it, you get to put a time that you want it. And I put 830 because I figured, you know what? Um, they're probably going to be busy later. I'm going to call for pizza later after I get out of work and I'm probably not going to get it. So I thought, well, this way I'll do 830. I can work my regular work day. And when I'm finished working, I can go get dressed, put some makeup on, make my margarita and the pizza will be here nice hot and fresh you know what time my pizza came today it came at 12 o'clock and i'm kind of like now i've got to smell this pizza all day long i don't want to just stop work and go film and then go back to work so anyway i worked to like i got off a little early went and got dressed filmed this so i could put it up today but 
Yeah, I was not happy with it coming at 12. I mean, if I was going to have a pe people coming over at like 8, 8 o'clock, 8.30 at night, why would I want to serve some pizza that's been sitting there since 12 o'clock? I was not happy, but you know what? I'm going to eat it anyway. So I just heated up a few pieces. And uh, so this one is their taco pizza. So it has on it like taco meat. They've got jalapeno bacon. I didn't put the olives on it. It's got onions and some peppers and it's got salsa mixed with some pizza sauce. It's got both mozzarella and cheddar cheese. It came with some sour cream. So I just put a few dollops on and then it's got crinkled up tortilla chips on it. So that looks good. And then I got a side of salsa in case I wanted a little bit more. Oh my god, I've been smelling this all day. Then I had to put it in the refrigerator because I figured it was going to go bad to sit there all day. So anyway, we are going to get this uploaded early tonight so that we can have it on for Cinco de Mayo. And I am so glad that you guys stopped in to visit. I hope everyone goes out, has a fantastic day. You know, I'm going to have to have a bite. I know, it's kind of rude. I'm going to have a sip and then I'm going to have a bite. That is really good. That is really good. So I got this little piece here. That's the corner, and you could ha have it on uh, the thin crust, regular crust, um, like the New York style, which is really good too, or a pan pizza. I went for the thin crust, figuring it's less calories. Whether or not it really is, I have no idea. So I'm just gonna have a quick bite. Mmm. sour cream on pizza is really good especially with the taco seasoning and the, the beef and have a little sip this is so good so anyway I got salt hanging off my lip I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in I would love to hear your plans what you're doing tonight if you're having takeout or delivery or if you're going to a restaurant or if you're making something from scratch some maybe some nice tacos or some enchiladas burritos oh my god i just love mexican food i might have to do some some more tomorrow well i got plenty of pizza maybe sunday i'll have room to order something else but anyway thank you guys so much and again i would love to hear your plans what you're doing and if you're having margaritas today or maybe if you're having sangria that sangria i had friday oh my god that was so so good i cannot wait to well because i got the bottle left but anyway i'm going to be ordering three more that is so good i might end up putting it in the pitcher and then maybe cutting up some oranges maybe put some grapes in there just kind of make it nice and fruity even more for summer with some ice really make it nice and cold that'll be really nice out on the deck um you know with summer if it gets here but anyway love to hear what you're having maybe a tequila sunrise i haven't had one of those in a while you know i've got orange juice left from when rena was here i'm pretty sure i've got grenadine i think i'm gonna have a tequila sunrise for breakfast tomorrow with my eggs and I'll probably put some salsa on my eggs yeah Cinco de Mayo I'm going to celebrate all weekend so anyway take care everyone stay safe be kind be happy enjoy life have some fun I love you guys so much thank you so much for stopping in I hope you give this video a com give this video a comment and give this video a thumbs up I would really appreciate it I appreciate each and every one of you I'm so blessed to have you in my life. So anyway, take care. Love you guys so much. And we'll see you in our next video.